Now keep an eye on all Jerry's accounts. And keep someone watching all the entrances to the bank. Bernie, Jerry Jacks has to be someone we're finding, okay? I can't stand this anymore. Do you, do you know how miserable I am? Of course you don't. You don't have any basic human emotions at all. But I have lots of emotions. And, and so does Spinelli. I'm sad and lonely and upset. And, and did I mention that I'm miserable? And I know Spinelli is miserable, too. You need to help. I'm busy. Oh, well, I have a broken heart, which is way more important than anything you could be busy doing. And I know that Spinelli has a broken heart, too. He needs me now more than ever. Why don't you be a true master to your grasshopper and teach him something he could really use? Make Spinelli forgive me. Spinelli is my essential person. My life means nothing without him. Hey, Spinelli isn't here. Now you tell me. Well, as long as I have your undivided attention, I can explain this whole situation. Lulu caused a huge misunderstanding about Johnny Zakara and led Spinelli to believe that I am not a sincere person and that his feelings for me are not returned, but they definitely are. And Spinelli won't listen to me, he'll only listen to you, so here is what we're gonna do. Okay, well, what are you talking about? You need to spontaneously tell Spinelli, actually, you don't do spontaneously, do you? That's okay, Spinelli won't notice, just casually drop it into a conversation or whatever conversation consists of in your world that you have noticed that Spinelli is kind of unhappy without me around and you would appreciate it if he would forgive me so we can all go back to the way things were. No, I'm not going to manipulate Spinelli. Everybody manipulates somebody sometime and then some of us are just a little more honest about it. Besides, it's not really manipulation if it's the truth. You just have to ask yourself, is Spinelli happier with me in his life or without me? He's actually doing pretty good. He's faking it. Well, he started a PI agency with Sam. I know they're at the office right now. Who knows what they're doing? So what you're really saying is Spinelli is dying. Not that you would be able to see it. I mean, why else would he be busying himself with all this new you stuff? You know, I don't want to be involved in this. You guys are going to have to work this out. You're okay, fine. Fine, fine. If you want help, Spinelli, you can help me. I mean, you're a guy. Tell me, how do you seduce someone? I, I can't help you seduce Spinelli. Of course you can. You're perfect. You're an emotionally shut off hitman, which makes you really observant, and you're kind of a babe magnet yourself. Besides, Spinelli's been living here for ages, so you must have observed something about him on some sort of level. I mean, what is he like? You're, you already slept with him. You don't need me to tell you how to make it happen again. Yeah, but this is post sleeping together, post huge fight, so this whole situation is different. It's not just about getting Spinelli into bed. I need a whole new approach. I know you think I'm not good for him. No, I think you're careless with him. See? That's what I'm talking about. That was a very observant thing to say. Look, I, I, I promise if I can work things out with Spinelli and get him back into my life, I won't be so careless with him anymore. I mean, he, he's my essential person. He means everything to me. If he didn't, I wouldn't be asking you for anything, ever. Okay, I get that you care about him, but you need to be talking to him, not to me. Not until I've done all my homework. I mean, what does he like about me? Has, has he mentioned anything specific? Maybe I should push up the whole sexy thing. What, what, what are you doing? Ooh, I could surprise Spinelli and wait for him in his bedroom, but that could come off obvious and seem sort of desperate. I need something a little more subtle. How's my perfume? Is it too much? There's always the sewer. The what? The sewer. You know, that, that's where Spinelli and I came together for the first time, sort of. In the sewer? Yeah, that's, that's when I saw what Georgie saw in him for the first time. Is there a mind shaft around here? Yeah. All Spinelli wants is for you to be honest. That's not true. Being honest with Spinelli is how we wound up here in the first place. I mean, if I had just let Spinelli go on believing that I was as hot for him as I was for Johnny Zakar, then Spinelli and I would be fine. So maybe that's what I need to do. Maybe I need to let Spinelli think that I am. Are you? You're not really listening. That part doesn't really matter. I mean, Spinelli is my essential person, so I just need to convince him that I feel the same way about him that he feels about me. Well, that's not fair to either one of you. I love Spinelli, and I need him in my life. So I'll just fake the physical part. It's completely dishonest, Maxie. It wouldn't be the first time that it happened in a relationship. Look, I really care about Spinelli and I want things to work out. And if you're not going to help, which you obviously won't, then you have to at least promise me that you're not going to tell Spinelli what's going on inside my head. I'm not sure I could. Uh, the business cards have been distributed dutifully. Maxie, Hello, Maxie. No, Spinelli, please don't call me that. I'm Maxie and I'm miserable without the jackal. Like I was just telling Jason, right, Jason? I gotta be somewhere. It was my understanding you were going to avoid coming to the house to protect yeah. Carly and Morgan. It's, it's really important, Jax. Is Carly around? She's not. She's at a doctor's appointment. She's pregnant. We're both convinced it's a girl, so... 
Yeah, Carly always wanted to have a baby girl. Not despite how you and I feel about each other, we both love Carly. So I'm asking you, I'm telling you, don't upset her. Then I shouldn't tell Carly that your brother's partner responsible for Michael getting shot. Well, you don't seem real surprised to hear Jerry got Michael shot. Nothing Jerry does surprises me, Jason. Has he contacted you? Carly can't ever know about this. You do understand that, right? I'm not going to do anything to her, Carly, so answer the Good. question. Has Jerry contacted yes, you? Yes, he sent me a DVD explaining his part in Michael's shooting. Okay, according to him, Devlin was going to shoot Sonny, and Michael was never the target. Okay, why, why did he contact you? He had an attack of conscience. He wanted to protect my relationship with Carly, okay? And since I'm partly responsible for... What happened to Michael? Because I helped Jerry after the hostage crisis. What, and, and you're sitting here still protecting the guy? How'd you find out about this anyway? Spinelli followed the cash. We got Jerry on tape taking money from me and Devlin's accounts, and Sonny and I put the pieces together. Oh, so Sonny knows about yeah, this? Yeah, we, we need to find Jerry. I assume he wants him dead. You got the DVD Jerry gave you? No, I destroyed it. When was the last time you saw your brother? Do you know where Jerry is? It doesn't matter if I've seen Jerry, okay? He's probably moved on. No, by it'll be a lot easier to protect Carly if Jerry's out of the picture. How much does Carly know? She knows he's alive. A few days after he sent the DVD, he called my office at the Metro Court and she happened to pick up the phone. I grabbed the phone from her right away and I told him to stay away. Okay, has he, has he contacted you since then? Look, he's probably halfway across the world by now, okay? There's no reason to come back to Port Charles. It'd be stupid if he tried. It's just. Do us all a favor and leave it alone. Don't pursue this. Michael is your stepson. He lived in this house. Don't you think he deserves justice, Jax? Don't you think that's what Carly wants for him? Is Max here? She left. You okay? Yeah, the heartbreak has helped me to focus on the task at hand. With distressing results, I, I, as you may know, the, the Jekyll created a, a complex con cross-referencing system to track the demented one, and it involves many well, alarms. Did you find Jerry? Yes, that's correct. Where is he? Right here in Port Charles.